Hi everyone, welcome to Artful Crafts. I wanted to show you what I got on a thrift haul um, last week actually. Um, my husband and I were riding back and forth um, out of town and I always usually try to hit the thrift stores while he's at work. Um, but I got this sewing basket. It's kind of up close the camera is. But it's in really good condition and I paid $2.99. And this was American Thrift Stores, but I think it's in pretty good condition. I'm not sure the age, and it's got the little pin cushion right here. I thought it was really sweet. And if I can't get some of the stains out, I'm going to um, recover maybe. But it's made in Philippines, and that, that's all it says. But I, I thought it was adorable and um, in pretty good shape. It just has a few stains, which I'll try to get out, but... It's just cute, and it's a great sewing basket. And let's see, I got some books. Uh, this is All American Cookbook Cairo, but it has some neat graphics in it. I liked. And this little, uh, I'm a sucker for uh, elf books and all these little uh, itty bitty tiny books, but look at the graphics. And I collect these, and I really don't need to, but. Maybe I can make some journals out of them. This is called the Three Weavers, and I'm not even sure what this is, but I thought it was some fun graphics. I'm not real sure what that is, but it was pink. <laughs> I got this book for like 25 cents, but look at this. I love the cover on it. It's on both sides. The spine's not real good, but I can fix that. And I can use this either as um, a journal or altered book. And just use the covers or use the, the whole book and alter it. I've kind of been wanting to do that, but it's such a good book to try. Uh, Civil War Handbook. And it's got some pretty good pictures in it. My husband likes war stuff, but he probably don't want that, so... And Afghans. I like the roses. And it has some neat graphics. That's a lot of work to do. This is too cute, but it don't have the songs with it. But the graphics are so adorable. Look at that. No music, though. No music. But it's cute. And let's see some piano with good graphics in it. So cute. I'm going to do some um, little golden books. And I think that those children's music would be cute. And this is a big helper um, elf book. But it's just, it's big. And the cover's a little bit messed up. But. I don't know if I would make a journal out of this or, sorry, I'm not in frame, a journal out of this or or just keep it. But probably a journal because it's, it's kind of torn up already. So it wouldn't hurt. But wouldn't that be cute for a little boy and have some pretty primary colors in it? Super cute. And Mother's Babies. This is another elf book. I'm not sure. Copyright. I'm not real sure. It doesn't say. Or I'm not looking at it, but just beautiful. Beautiful pictures. Now this, look. Ah! It's one of my favorites as a child. So precious. Ah, oh, I love these graphics. My little kitties. Just really pretty. And I'm fixing to have a little baby granddaughter, so hey, that might be good for her. I'm thinking this is an old dish rag or something, but I like it. Or um, maybe a, I'm not real sure, towel, hand towel or something, but I thought that'd be pretty. Um, even in, it's in good condition, except for right there. Um, maybe a journal cover, that would be cute. And I'm going to make a strawberry journal soon. 
And I got these for like a dollar fifty and several cards. I haven't even opened them. I just saw the strawberry in the basket with the red and I thought they were really cute. Oh yeah, that is really precious. Look. So cute. And it's all I think it's postcards. Oh, that's adorable. I love them. That'd be cute in the strawberry journal. And of course, ideas, country ideas. I love the graphics in these. I pick them up. I have about maybe five, but I pick them up when I can because, you know, older graphics and stuff. Look at that, that's pretty. And modern mathematics. Oh my gosh. Some of y'all may be too young, but do y'all remember when you had to take these and go to the copier and make copies? Look, I got them. I love them. I thought those were just too cool. Because I remember I got two two books like that. And they were like 25 cents each. I got a Mother's Day Ideas book. Look at this. That's so pretty. Can you see that? Yeah. And I love swans. Just amazing. Pretty, pretty graphics. Love it. And another Mother's Day. That's sweet. Yeah, so I, I like these. I got some good things in them. But look what I also found. It was in a sewing basket. I didn't see a lot of... Um, it was in... A, actually, it had patterns in a box. And I saw this little box. I was like, oh, what's that? But um, I'm not real sure exactly what it is. I'll have to look it up. But this is the box. And my friend, Laura, Laura knows who she is, may know what this is. I have no idea. The lady said maybe tatting, but I'm not sure about tatting. But And it looks old. I'm not real sure. And this looks like maybe a leaf. But oh my goodness. That is so sweet. And this is just maybe covering up. It's, it's like on there. I'm not real sure how it came. But then look at this. This is precious to me. This is that Myra Dick is advanced from second year to the third year of the junior department. Methodist Sunday School. And this is in 1940. Look at that. That's so awesome. I could probably keep this and maybe make copies. Is that not sweet? So, yeah, I love this thrift stores and I'm addicted to thrift stores and probably have too much as it is now. But, uh, Laura, if you know what that is, let me know. But anyway, that was my thrift haul. Um, thanks for watching and have a good day. Bye-bye.